Hi, I'm Kamalika Saha and I'm the Speaker Liaison Director for GAP Summit 2017. Today with me, I have Dr. Michael Weiner, who's the Chief Medical Information Officer at IBM Healthcare. Welcome, Good Michael. Thank you. Uh, so IBM Watson is a big player in the digital health arena. What is the current buzzword and what is yet to come? Yeah, I think th this is the year, this is the era of cognitive computing. Mm -hmm. um, I think you know, in the past we might have thought of it as artificial intelligence, mm -hmm. and now we like to think of it as augmented intelligence. Right. So in healthcare, we, we, with the amount of data that's coming forward, forward and the amount of information available, mm -hmm. cognitive computing is going to really drive, drive the industry. That's amazing. So my quick question, so for a successful digital health enterprise, there needs to be an effective collaboration between the healthcare and the biotech ecosystem, yeah. as well as the tech solution entities. So do you see a shift in perception? Are people open to accepting it? I, I think not only are people open now, but it's almost mandatory for success. In the past, there would be separate entities and each would do their own work. And we quickly found that and neither neither party um, got the uh, got the value out of each other's work. So putting those two together, mm -hmm. building in technology into the clinical workflow, building technology into the discovery workflow, has really just changed our ability to get drugs to market faster and deliver better care. That's amazing. So one of the key objectives of digital health is to make sure that the right technologies and the quality care goes to the right people. And a part of it is diminishing the borders. Yeah. So what has been your experience with that? Yeah, I mean, this is what's so exciting about technology. It's really just flattened the world. Right. And the example that uh, I'll, I'll share with you is we have trained Watson for Oncology um, with the Memorial Sloan Kettering in New York City. And so now Watson has been lifted and moved into a rural area in Manipal in India, into a rural areas in China, rural areas in Thailand, in places that would have never been able to have their patients seen in a Memorial Sloan Kettering. They're now getting Memorial Sloan Kettering care. Incredible. That's exciting. Uh, so you have been a fantastic leader in the health information technology enterprise. So what do I you... Try. <laughs> Uh, so what is your advice to the leaders of tomorrow who are venturing into this field? Yeah, I think it's really education. Mm -hmm. right? I mean, I think you just need to be educated on the field. Each field has its own language and its own, its own uh, thought process, its experience. Mm -hmm. So, you know, I, I teach it, uh, at a local university. And I just tell people to, you know, go do internships, just lean in, uh, find a mentor. Right. And then, and then, so your experience, your education, mentorship, and try to bring all that together into a career. Awesome. Thank you, Mike. And for all you guys, stay tuned in. And there are many more videos on the YouTube channel of Gap Summit. Thank you.